Hey, what's up? Welcome back to Nerd Life Channel with no hands. And today, I want to show you guys my fastest way of getting XP and leveling up. Yes, double candies is over, but we still got the six hour lures going on. I still got a whole bunch of candies that I've been hoarding. Mainly for XP grinding. Raditas, Pidgeys, what else? Weedles. Uh, since those are all 12 candies to evolve, that's my method. Those are the main three that I focus on to catching and evolving. Also, uh, like other Pokemon, like that you need like 25 candies to evolve. Those are good also to uh, to XP grind, like Raditas, 25. Uh, who else? Um, uh, not Venonat. It's 50 to evolve that Venonat. But uh, Oddish, 25 to evolve. So even those, I still uh, try to grind for candies and XP. And here I am. We got a Team Valor gym here. We got four Pokestops. Two of them are pretty far away from me. So I'm just going to lure this one up. Take advantage of that uh, six hours. Yeah, it's 9:30 a.m. right now, so I don't gotta go pick up carry until one. So I got good over three hours of just grinding right here. So it takes 12 candies to evolve any of those Pokemon that I just said, except the Rattata, and. With that said, what I do is I always stockpile candies, just, not just on this event that just passed by, but all the time I always make sure to stock up on those candies because I like to do evolution runs. And what I do is I catch a Pokemon while I have over 500 or 1,000 candies for that specific type of Pokemon. I catch it on a lucky egg, so I get three candies for catching it. I get one candy for evolving it and one candy for transferring it so that's a total of five candies and then it's 12 candies to evolve so catching it and then evolving it as soon as you catch it you're only spending seven candies for the evolution of a thousand or more xp you know because you're getting five three for catching it one for evolving it and one for transferring it so you're only spending seven for a thousand plus XP that's my method that's what I do while I'm catching and grinding catching and grinding and evolving catching evolving catching evolving catching and evolving that's my method that's what I've been able to get to level 34 in less than four months because I got I started playing Pokemon Go around the middle of August my daughter gave me this account at level 5 yeah it's a funny story behind that too a Jotini oh my god oh my god I bury you baby bury you and I think I have enough candies for a dragon I can I gotta do some some uh, some major evolutions and some power ups. That's gonna come for other videos in the future. I'm not playing. I'm not playing. Not with a Jatini. Boom. Right in the nose. Got quiet. 104. Teeny candies. Well, proud? Hmm. Not too shabby. Here goes, show you guys my team. Got Valor Cart, Woodbite, and Hydro Pump. Over 3000 CP. My pride and joy. I had to. I had to power him up. And I powered him. He's been in this gym for, I want say, going on almost two months. My Alakazam. I'm gonna max him out soon. Got my Arcanine, gonna max him out. 
with the best defender moveset, Fire Fang and Flamethrower. I love that Flamethrower. It's it's awesome seeing them blow the fire out of their mouth. <sighs> Gengar, 95% IVs. It's the perfect. He's not even completely maxed out, but I just left him at 2400 CP because he looks, he looks, he looks perfect right there. And my Kingler gotta max him out too. Cause got plenty more. We max him out. My Fibonacci. Another one of my pride and joy right there. With water gun and rock slide, which is the legendary move set. You can't get that move set anymore. And my muck. Another proud enjoy here. My Moko. With the best defender move set. Polyrath with the best defender moveset and he's 100% perfect IVs. Then I got my Needle King with the perfect defender moveset as well. He's already maxed out. I gotta level up to power him up some more. Soon, soon, soon. So yeah. So I feel like walking over there to go get those poke stops. Actually, it's not that cold today. It looks gloomy, but yesterday it was a little bit more windy and chilly compared to today. Let's see what we got going on over here. I haven't even had breakfast yet. Gotta go get pick that up too. Probably go to Jimmy John's. No, 10 Valor Gym, of course, always red over here. Pizza, Halo, Misley. Simple man, that. There you go. I usually gotta travel out of town to, just to get into some gyms because Team Valor got got this on lockdown over here. Not that I'm complaining, but I like to have gyms too. Right now I only got three, four, yeah, four. You know, and I'm the type of guy that likes to have more than ten gyms just in case if I get knocked out of any. I always make sure to have 10 to collect that stardust, you know? Yeah, we finally got Carrie. Hi, Carrie. Hi. And now we're gonna go get some chops. I don't know, I didn't go over there at all. I just went to the Metro, trying to get some wheels and potatoes, but there weren't none, and then just that tourism and Tini I told you about. Oh, dang, look at that. They're gone. That guy was stupid. He almost hit them. Yeah. Okay, you wanted to walk all the way over there for one poke stop, and because there's some chop nest here too.
too fast. <laughs> <laughs> now you have yourself looking out on camera. That's what happens when you challenge flying That's nimbus. what happens when, uh, <laughs> when I challenge flying Nimbus now. I, I sabotage myself, so just to let her win, because last time I, mm. I, I whooped her, oh, I left her in the dust. Oh, yeah. But we are going to have a rematch run, too. I, I, I'm not satisfied with that. Not at all. You remember what happened last time we, we ran, we, we raced, right? What happened last time? You were really that excited. didn't happen. You were really excited to get some vertical velocity. Yeah, I was. It was a six flag. This is the <laughs> we raced. Last time. Four, oh, there's a machop here? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven There is a machop here. Another one. Did he spawn for you already? This is probably going to be the last catch for today. This is a public campground, May through October. Come tent it over here. Oh yeah, we're getting new berries too. Can't wait for that. New berries. Oh, it's gonna be exciting. Very exciting. Pokemon Go is not dead. For any of y'all that were thinking that. It's been revived. Resurrected. 